Hey guys, Nick Haskins. Just wanted to take a couple minutes to show you how I overlay these textures using Corel PaintShop Pro Photo 12. PaintShop Pro is by far my favorite program. I do have Photoshop, however I found that Corel is uh, a lot easier. I've been using it for a long time, I know all the keystrokes, and it does 98% of uh, everything that Photoshop does. So with that being said, we'll go ahead and get started. This is a wonderful image here of Phil and Nancy from our last engagement shoot. It's a fabulous picture as it is, but I think we can do a little more. So what we're going to go do, it, do is open up one of our textures, Control O is the hotkey for uh, opening a file. Let's scroll down and we're going to pick wood 3 here. Hit open. Now you can overlay this texture as is, or you can kind of uh, use your brain a little bit and see that you've got heavy on this side and you need to throw something on this side. It kind of just makes sense. So what you're going to do is, you see this is heavy on this side, so you're going to go to Image, Mirror. It's going to flip that baby right around. Control C, copy that. And X out of that, don't change it, you're not going to need it anymore. Control L, smack that down as a layer. Now you're going to walk over here to Layers, down to Overlay, and there's your starting point. Take your opacity, down to 50 as a starting point. See how it looks. In this case, it looks a little dark, so we'll go down uh, to about 40 or so. I think that looks good. 42, whatever. So now you see we have our textured photo. Uh, people don't like themselves being textured, so what we're going to do is go ahead and paint that texture off of them. Go ahead and tap your X key for your eraser. Make sure your size is at about 100. You're going to go ahead and paint the texture right off of them doesn't have to be perfect, just go right along and take the texture right off. You don't have to zoom in, you don't have to make sure you're staying in the lines or anything like that because these photos aren't going to be blown up to 20 by 30. And just go right along. And 10 seconds later, you are pretty much done. Just like that. And there you have it. Of course, you can go to uh, layers and you can merge all these, flatten them back into one, and F12. Save it as your new texture photo. And there you have it. This is the uh, first tutorial using Corel. Plan on coming out with a lot more. Uh, these textures can be found on the photographers pro shop.com John Magnoski has done a fabulous job putting that site together uh, you can find some of his textures on there as well which I highly recommend I have them myself uh, again that's www.photographersproshop.com I am Nick Haskins and we'll see you next time